The number one most antioxidant rich single whole food on the planet on average is amla, otherwise known as dried powdered Indian gooseberry, with up to a hundred times more antioxidants by weight than blueberries. Described as an Ayurvedic wonder, does amla really live up to its claimed benefits, most importantly, its ability to lower high cholesterol? Well, in this video, I'm gonna be diving deep into the scientific literature and seeing if amla is helpful, harmful, or just a plain hoax. Hello, my name is Dr. Tessa Spencer. I'm a licensed pharmacist as well as a NASM certified personal trainer and nutrition coach. And my method to achieving success in my clients is simple. I use evidence-based nutrition, exercise, superfoods, and supplements to optimize your health. If you have questions about any of my services, including wellness coaching, supplement consult, self-care recommendations, or medication therapy management, use that link below in my description to book a free wellness consultation and see how I can help you solve your health problems. If this video helps you in any way, I would really appreciate it if you could like it, share it with anyone who might benefit this knowledge, or subscribe to my channel. Finally, it's always important to note that natural remedies, superfoods, and supplements can interact with certain disease states and medications. So make sure you're talking with your person personal healthcare provider and pharmacist before supplementing with anything. Amla is so revered that you find scientists making statements like, every part of the Indian gooseberry plant has its unique therapeutic characteristics for a remedy of almost all ailments and can be adopted as a single bullet against disease. Okay, you have my attention. Now there was a study that found extraordinary improvements in total cholesterol and LDL cholesterol in humans, but that was compared to a placebo. What about comparing it to a leading cholesterol lower drug like Sinvastatin. Treatment with the drug produced significant reductions in cholesterol, as one would expect, but the AMLA produced significant reductions almost equivalent to Sinvastatin. Now note, this was only about a 10 to 15% drop in total and LDL cholesterol, but in the study the AMLA dose was only a tenth of a teaspoon and they used not just the powdered fruit, but they actually used the powdered juice of the fruit. How about AMLA versus Lipitor, aka Atorvastatin? Lipitor is another cholesterol lowering drug and the study found that significant improvements for the drug and significant improvements for the two AMLA doses, but once again, only about a 15% drop in cholesterol. But this one, they weren't even using juice from the fruit. They were using an extract. So what about if we put the powdered fruit, no extract, no fruit juice, but the actual fruit to the test? Well, check out this study, the effect of AMLA fruit on blood sugars and cholesterol levels of normal subjects and type two diabetic patients. Ideally, we want our total cholesterol under 150. The average cholesterol in the United States is over 200, which is where the diabetics in this study started out. When you gave the study subjects about a half teaspoon of AMLA powder a day, a significant decrease in total cholesterol, LDL cholesterol values were observed in the normal healthy volunteers, as well as the diabetic patients. Looking at the numbers, it was like a 35 to 45% drop in cholesterol in just three weeks. I mean, this is absolutely astounding. That's the kind of results that we see in like six months after putting someone on a statin drug. So as you can tell, I am a huge fan of AMLA and the results of the current study suggest that AMLA does have lipid lowering properties and might be useful as a plant food supplement for high cholesterol. Now, if you wanna learn about more superfoods and supplements that have a clinical benefit and could be potentially helpful for your health, I do offer personalized supplement protocols, online personalized wellness coaching, self-care recommendations, and medication therapy management. And mainly I'm trying to help people go from being overwhelmed, frustrated, and confused about what they need to do to get real results to being self-efficient, energized, and in full control of their health. To discover if any of my services might be a benefit to you, use that link below in my description to book a free wellness consultation. It's about a 15 minute obligation-free meeting where I'm answering your questions and providing you with solutions to your healthcare needs. My services are step-by-step -step and they are backed with proven results. If you have any questions, make sure to put them below in the comments and make sure to check out all my scientific references that I used in creating this video in my description. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. I hope to see you in the next video, but until then, keep living your worth.